Good morning everyone. It's Friday today, the third day of bike week and since I woke up in the morning, all I have been hearing is just this. I don't know how clear can you hear that or not, but that's all the bike sounds since 5 in the morning. Just look at that. There we go. My hotel is right on the main street and bikes are just flying over here and everyone is just loud and fun. Yesterday was another crazy day. This town has two colors. One is during the daytime when it's at a little bit peaceful but at night time, oh my god, I cannot explain the fun, the parties and all the things that are happening over here are just too much because at every moment there are at least six, seven, eight, nine huge vendors, huge stages live performances in every single bar every single place i wish i could record at night time but i cannot because the camera will not pick up those colors at night and it's not that much fun but i still try to capture as much as i can from my phone and show you guys but anyways for the time being my friends are waiting for me at a coffee shop and i need coffee so badly so we'll go join them and i'll try to show you guys as much as i can though i cannot show you everything but i'll still try my best let's get let's put the shoes on and head out Look at the beautiful bikes. Ah, time to go and see some more bikes. Oh my god. My bike is locked and I just started it. Man oh man. Ah. Ah. Ah, what a hassle. Ha, there we go. Okay. Woo -hoo -hoo. Here we are. Early in the morning, I mean it's not that early, 12 o'clock, almost midday, but a beautiful weather, just look around, Ooh, what a weather for bikes, it's a little bit chilly, that is because there's a tornado or storm passing by, couple of miles or hundreds of miles down in the ocean, <coughs> I think that's why it's chilly, but hey, Ooh, another good day, in Ocean City Bike Week. Let's try to go on the main street and see if we can find some bikes over there. I've been hitting them and now on this road I don't even see any. Oh, look at that. Oh, man, oh man, yeah. It's too hard to ride naked, right? <laughs> look at that. Nice. Be careful on that, I just got rid of one of them. These ones? Oh, okay. I know, I know. Oh, here we go. <laughs> Look who I found. <laughs> Good morning, sir. I took the bus. You took the bus? Yeah. Okay. What about your place? You were gone. I'm like, oh, I'll be catch up. I, I just moved out. Oh, that's a beautiful bike. Look at that. Whee! All the bikes. All of these bikes. Oh, so many cops. This is where the main event is happening, right over here. That's why there are cops over here. Ooh, did something happen? Now they're just directing the traffic. Ooh this is crazy over here. I think we need to come back in this convention to see all those bikes. Because today, Friday and tomorrow, Saturday, those are the two prime days of this bike week where all the bikers come from all the area many many bikers every single where look at the number of bikes yes sir i like snapping my fingers so that's what they are doing <laughs> but i think as i was saying we'll go back to the convention because these bikes i'm glad that our other hotel is right over here so we don't need to ride over there we'll just park our bikes in the parking lot of the hotel and just walk Look at all these bikes coming in crazy. <laughs> Someone just got pulled over. I think that's what that guy was trying to tell me to be careful on this bike because this is a fast bike. And that's what that guy was trying to tell me to not to go too fast around because there are so many cops. 
and as we just see a biker cop just pulled over that guy Ooh. i think i should put that down to <laughs> highway mode rather than sports mode here we are let's park our bike and go up to grab our other partner It was good to see everyone still alive and breathing after a crazy last night that I cannot say much about over here. Anyways, we were super hungry. So the moment we met, we decided to go out to eat something, some good food, which was right next to our place. Just got the boys and now finally going to eat something. As you can see, the roads all around us, bikes and bikes everywhere. But first thing first, need some food, need some coffee before we actually start partying. which is so true because we didn't had much food since last morning that's why we chose not to find a place here and there and instead go to a place right next to our hotel which was called the tap house now tap house is a beautiful bayside bar slash restaurant and had some amazing food i ordered my crab cake sandwich and let me tell you they were good nice <laughs> crab cake sandwich it's nice nice yes sir so that food was good the belly is all full and we are happy right now we are right now the plan is that to go to a sales bar because that's where the other convention is happening so many conventions different spots or the hit the mall and see all those beautiful bikes but first thing first what a clean our bikes look at this beauty now when it's all cleaned and looks nice <sighs> time to hit sales very but there's something really very new and funny and that is that i have got so many compliments on this bike like everyone who looks at this bike wants to know what kind of bike it is like they have never seen this bike before and guess what uh today's friday and there are hundreds and hundreds of thousands of bikes over here and i haven't seen a single other bike like this one neither did my buddies over here and we're still trying to find if anyone else also rides sportster s oh harley davidson did a very bad job in marketing this beautiful beast you know yesterday it was so funny right over here there was a uh, Super bike sports bikes a group going on and I was teasing around with the Hayabusa. <laughs> That was so much fun. The guys behind him on R5 and R1 I think they were like what are you doing? I'm like oh, just playing around having some fun because I have been looking into that Hayabusa and Sportster S are almost pretty close to each other. The 0 to 60 on a Hayabusa is I think 3.2 and on this one is 3.4. and my neighbor Rob was telling me that if i do the exhaust this will do 0 to 60 even under 3 and be faster than hayabusa how about that how about that wow right now we are on the bridge going towards salisbury and just look at the number of traffic that is coming into ocean city maryland for the weekend so many people on the cars and the bikes and those people on the cars 70 80% are those who have their bikes in already or maybe there's some Woo! look at the traffic this is all the traffic coming in towards ocean city maryland for the bike week festival weekend friday saturday you heard that right 25 miles is salisbury from here so we'll hit the highway and we'll see you in salisbury Just give me few seconds. Here we go. Woo! I think we are close by because all the bikers are turning over here. Yep, there are sign boards that says bike right lane. Yep, 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 yep. So this is Salisbury Stadium or that's what they call it. And I think that's where the vendors are, and that's where all the bikes are going and coming out from. I think we are close by because all the bikers are turning over here. Yep, there are sign boards that says bike right lane. Yep, 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 yep. So this is Salisbury Stadium, or that's what they call it. And I think that's where the vendors are, and that's where all the bikes are going and coming out from. Ooh! 
<laughs> Look at those bikes. Wow, holy smokes. Look at that. Every single bike is here, but yet still we haven't seen my bike. <laughs> Wow, look at these beautiful bikes. Ooh, beauty. Is good here? Okay. Ooh, time to go in and explore. That was a good ride. The convention at Salisbury was packed with a lot of riders riding their beautiful bikes and creating an amazing vibe but the only thing that was missing over there was the energy. That is the reason we only spent like almost 20 to 30 minutes over there and we were back on the road towards Ocean City where the real energy of the bike week was. And we are back from Salisbury into Ocean City, Maryland right now at Fakers Island going to have some snacks, seeing all these bikes on this side. It's a beautiful spot over there, right by the beach. Ooh, so many amazing spots over here, so much fun. Bike Week Ocean City. This is Figures Island and this was a nice little spot, a little bit fancy and that means it was a little bit expensive also. That is the reason we were also here for just a short time, enjoyed the vibe, enjoyed the views and then dished this place too. Because no doubt that this was a good fancy place but the only thing that was still missing was the Bike Week vibe. Ooh, that was a nice spot but a little bit over expensive uh, that's why we just bailed out from that place and right now going towards the center of the town where all the fun is and all the things are happening let's see what we can find over there and what kind of bikes we will see because friday night the main night friday and saturday Ooh. Let me tell you, the streets are jam-packed. All the highways coming in towards Ocean City are jam-packed. If you're on the car, good luck, man. Now, before we would continue, we came back to our hotel, parked our bikes over there and took a short break. Once we were all recharged for the night, we called an Uber and went towards the main areas where the real fun was happening. And let me tell you, because it was Friday night, it was even more jam-packed and busier than the previous nights. And we, the Three Musketeers, had an amazing and a blasting fun night, about which most of the things you know I cannot tell you over here, but all I can say is that it was hey feel i'm in the move for a switch up i hit the function hit the rose till i hiccup